This sound could be coming to a town near you. There's long been plans to expand the metro rail from the university at Buffalo South Campus to the North Campus. Now we're getting a better idea of where those proposed tracks will be. The NFTA says it'll be more cost effective to construct tracks on Niagara Falls Boulevard compared to Bailey Avenue. It makes more sense to us. Brian Kulpa, the Amherst Town Supervisor, believes the proposed light rail will help businesses on Niagara Falls Boulevard. Every community you know, in the U.S. who's, who's serious about revitalization who's serious about revitalization of some of their big box retail, who's serious about bringing in dynamic companies um, to set up within a university district, are doing so in planning and planning around mass transit options. The new proposed route puts the above ground tracks right on the Amherst Tonawanda border. This route would cost $200 million off the final price tag. The train would go above ground in between traffic on the boulevard just north of Kenmore and turn right towards UB on Maple. Now we're also getting a better sense of a timetable for this project. The hope is to have shovels in the ground by 2025 and service to UB North by 2030. But there are still a lot of steps that need to take place before any construction. The NFTA wants to know what you think about this project. They're hosting a public meeting on December 6th. Jeff Rusak, 7 Eyewitness News.